The most prominent pieces of equipment in the Christmas tree are gate valves, located directly above the tubing head adapter. These include the master valve, crown valve, and wing valves. Christmas trees always have one gate valve called the master valve, and commonly two are used. The advantage of a dual master valve assembly is that it allows the top valve to be used for routine operations, while the lower valve is used for isolation, replacement, or maintenance of the upper valve. A safety valve or activated valve is often installed on gate valves to prevent continued flow through the valve when downstream pressure becomes abnormal. The activated valve, termed actuator by the API, is fitted on top of a gate valve and opens or closes the gate valve using either compressed air or pressurized hydraulic fluid. The compressed gas or pneumatic actuator utilizes compressed air or produced gas to operate the valve. This gas pressure is applied to the piston, holding it down into the open position. A spring closes the valve if pressure falls below a predetermined value. Hydraulic valves differ mainly in that hydraulic fluid is used to move the piston. They are more commonly used when the actuator and subsurface safety valve are both controlled by the same system. Above the actuator is the production T, which directs flow from a vertical to a horizontal path. A gate valve is often placed above the production T to facilitate the easy installation or removal of a lubricator. This gate valve is usually called a crown or working valve. On top of this crown valve, or if no crown valve is used on top of the production T, a tree cap is installed. The tree cap provides quick access to the tubing bore for wire line or other operations. A pressure gauge is installed in the tree cap to enable flowing and shut-in wellhead pressures to be recorded. All equipment in the vertical run from the tree cap to the tubing must have an inside diameter equal to or greater than the outside diameter of the tubing. The installation of the casing head and spools includes the pack-off of each casing outside diameter and the inside diameter of each wellhead component. The term pack-off generally refers to the seal acting in the bottom bowl or the top bowl above the slips, but can apply to all bowls. A typical pack-off would be an O-ring located in grooves in the lower bowl. These seals are effective due to the dimensions of the seal and to extrusion of the sealing element when pressure is applied. Some seals can be activated by injecting plastic into the ports located on the casing spool. A test plug is a wellhead accessory used primarily during drilling. The test plug allows the casing head top connection up through the BOP stack to be tested during the drilling stage. Additional information about test procedures is given in your manual. Offshore drilling operations utilizing surface mounted blow preventers are limited to certain types of bottom supported platforms. Surface Christmas tree. In the oil and gas industry, a Christmas tree is referred to as a series of valve and spool assembly, fitted on top of the well. A Christmas tree is installed on top of the last casing spool on a surface well, or the high pressure well head housing for a subsea well. This image demonstrates the drawing of a Christmas tree and well head of a surface well head. The Christmas part is located at the top part, showing in a blue box, and the well head part is the lower section showing in a red box. Its functions are as follows, allow reservoir fluid to flow from the well to the surface safely in a controlled manner. Allow safe access to the well bore in order to perform well intervention procedures. Allow injections such as water or gas injection. Provide access to hydraulic line for a surface control subsurface safety valve. Provide electrical interface for instrumentation and electrical equipment for electrical submersible pump. In this video, it will describe about important components of a surface Christmas tree, which is referred to as any Christmas tree used above water level. A master valve is located above the tubing hanger, and its function is to allow the well to flow or shut the well in. Typically, there are two master valves. One is called a lower master valve, and another is an upper master valve. Two valves are often used because they provide redundancy. If one master valve cannot function properly, another valve can perform the same task. 
This illustration shows a simple diagram of upper and lower master valves in the Christmas tree. T-type fitting, T-block, allows diversion of flow stream from vertical to a horizontal flow line. A wing valve is located on the side of a Christmas tree, and it is used to control or isolate production from the well into surface facilities. Depending on each design of a Christmas tree, it can be equipped with one or two wing valves. Some operators require two production wing valves, one as a main production and another one as a backup valve. In many cases, one wing valve is used for production and another wing valve is used as a kill wing valve. Choke is the smallest restriction in a Christmas tree, and its function is to control the production rate of a well. It is also used to control sand production in some cases. A choke restricts areas for production flow through a bean, or an orifice inserted into a choke body. Two types of chokes are as follows. First type is a positive choke with interchangeable beans. Second type is an adjustable choke which allows adjusting the choke size easily. On a Christmas tree, a swab valve is the topmost valve providing vertical access to the well for well intervention operations conducted by wire line, slick line, coiled tubing or a snubbing unit. T cap is a flange located on top of the swab valve which allows a wireline lubricator or a coil tubing, snubbing unit BOP to connect to a well, in order to perform well intervention programs. A pressure gauge is used to monitor the pressure of the well. Nowadays, most of the operators often use electronic gauges so pressure and temperature data can be transmitted via an electronic system for better well monitoring. A unitized Christmas tree is an integrated Christmas tree, which consists of a lower and upper master valve, and a swab valve in one body. This will allow an operator to save operational time for installation.